Oh, hello, my friends. Come in. Come in, come into the kitchen. So, this morning I've done, this is my third swipe in black. My first swipe I really liked, but it didn't, uh, colors weren't sort of sitting right. And it was a little too liquidy, so I went back, and it was my own fault because I added quite a bit of flow trial to my base coat because I find the Walmart black onyx in semi-gloss is really, really thick. So I always thin it with flow trial, but I think I got a little heavy handed with the flow trial. So my first piece was shifting and moving more than I liked and I knew I wouldn't like it in the end. So I scraped it and did my second piece. And my second piece is kind of weird, kind of like me, but I like it, I think. So I'm just gonna kind of sit on it let it maybe dry and then I'll reevaluate. But I still thought that my base coat was still a little bit too thin. So this time I've taken the same base coat and I've just added a little bit of polyurethane. And um, we're gonna try again. Polyurethane will, will thicken your paints right up. I quite often use it in my actual paint paints um, if they're too thin. And I'm not gonna put the satin enamel in this time because I think that's when I say my pour was weird. I think that's part of it, is I used Big Work Satin Enamel in buff, and it still kind of breaks apart a little bit. Not like white, but it's still kind of cloudy. So, I'm not sure what I'm doing. I should have had all this out before I turned the video on, but I didn't. So here we go. All right. So we're gonna just do a whole bunch of different color. So this is TLP in cappuccino. Pretty, pretty color. Uh, this is pink. Yeah, I know, pink. Pink and brown, I get it. Uh, I don't know what pink it is. It was, at one time it was a pink and I was too thin, and so I thought I was adding pouring medium, and I was actually adding white paint, so I came up with this very light shade of pink. This is a TLP mixture. Um, I believe it started as lily pad, and then I added a little bit of blue paint to it. So now I have a darker teal, darker than lakeside. Um, yeah, it's kind of pretty. I like it. And then we're gonna throw in maybe another TLP color. This is actually, this is actually a card pigment. This is Interference Violet. It's a tiny bit thick. So we're gonna use our paw. If you weren't listening in the last video, you guys, you don't know what paw is. So I'll tell you, because I'm a nice kind of girl. Polyacrylic water, it's my new term. Lots of people are using this Josonia water mix and I haven't opened my Josonia yet. I'm kind of saving it for a special day. I don't know what day that is, but I'm saving it. And so I mix polyacrylic and water and we're gonna call it paw, just for fun. Okay, we're gonna swipe in white and black, but we're gonna start in white. And I'm actually gonna add some more color. I'm gonna add some more pink. Why not? I'm on this pink kick. Me who never pours in pink. Look at me go. I don't know what color pink this is, but I believe it is FX. And I think FX calls it red. But it is actually pink. Okay. Now we're gonna swipe in white. We're gonna swipe it out in white and black. my crazy swiping today you guys okay look at that pretty pink on black I don't even like pink 
Well, not, not much anyway. So we're just going to keep playing with this and we're going to maybe add some more swipes in white and some more swipes in black. And yeah, we're just going to fiddle and fart around with this, you guys. That's what we're here to do. So I've talked to a whole bunch of different people lately. And I can feel the frustration level. Oh, like me throwing paint on the floor. Um, I can feel the frustration level on trying to get these swipes right and trying to get your blooms right. And it's it's a tough process, guys. And you have to be patient and be kind to yourselves. It takes time. There is a learning curve. And you know what? Some people just get it really easy. And some people have to struggle and fight. Um... Yeah, I, I've spent a lot of time, like people will say to me, oh, everything you do is amazing. Well, no, it's not amazing. And I say this all the time. I have my more than my share of complete epic failures. And for every video you guys see, I think I said this on my last video too, so I'm not on glue. I'm just repeating myself. For every video that you guys see, there is at least two to three to four more that gets scraped up and plopped right back in that cup. So you have to remember that. Um, yeah, and be nice to yourselves. Be good to you. You know, you take what other people do and you want to do the same colors and you know, you have to just, you have to do you. What works for me isn't going to work for you and what works for you isn't going to work for me. So you have to Take someone's recipe that's tried, true, trusted, and worked, and then you have to just kind of tweak it and make it your own. It's really, really important. I, I've been there. Not so long ago, I was ready to toss it all. I've said many, many times. Now I can't because I have new windows and I don't want to break them. But before, I could have launched my pates a million times. Okay, simple pretty I like the pink and I'm gonna leave it right there I'm not even gonna muck around with it as she picks it up I'm just gonna kind of get this paint on the one corner a little bit better this is how I go about wrecking things when I say I'm not gonna touch it and then I then I do Okay, that's it, we're stopping right there. That's its resting spot. Okay, that was easy. So I'm happier now with my block. I can already tell that I definitely added way too much slow trawl. I can tell just by the way my paints are sitting on the top of it right now that they're not gonna shift too much, which is a good thing because I don't want them to. Yeah, it's as simple as that. So I'm gonna bring you guys down and remind you all, be nice to yourselves, guys. Don't be so hard on yourself. You know, it's only paint. You guys can all do this. Consistency is absolutely 100% your key. I've just done two pieces this morning and I've poured hundreds and hundreds and I thought I had my base coat right and it wasn't right. So be nice to yourselves. All right, let's bring you down. Closer look. Look at that. I know, for all of us that don't really care for pink, I know, but this is pretty, got to admit. So look at all these cells. Yeah, soft and delicate and then kind of punches of color. All right, my friends, that's it. I'm happy now. Everything seems to be back in order in my kitchen. And um, I'm wearing clothes now. That's a good thing. If you were with me this morning at 6 o'clock, I was pouring in my PJs, guys. Pouring in my PJs. All right, my friends, poor happy, stay safe. We'll talk really, really soon. I'm sure I will be back with something else. Bye, guys.